So this Anthurium magnificum spadix is receptive. See all the little droplets? So I'm going to find, let's see here, this is um, crystalline dark. So it's really simple. You just take pollen with a paintbrush. You could also use your fingers. And then you rub it up and down on the spadix. You do this for a few mornings in a row. Pollen right on the spadix. So this is the male stage, female stage, a few days in a row. This is an older Magnificum inflorescence. Here is a Forgetii inflorescence that has been pollinated also. Um, and you can see it's forming little berries. See the little bumps protruding? So those will turn red in a few weeks and be berries. And it's important to label so you know what you crossed with. Also putting some sort of a plastic cover is also good so that um, because cross pollination can just happen also. Um, so I'm really excited. Let's see what the Magnificum and Crystallinum dark babies will look like. I'm really excited about this. Okay, bye.